What's good, everybody? My name is Christic, and welcome back to Pokemon Shield. Oh, hello. Yes, hello, you cute little squishy loaf boy. Uh, whoa! Oh, no, 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 no. Did I get him? Oh, my God. What kind of zigzagoon are you? Oh! Oh, I know which one this one is. Okay. Uh, let's do a quick attack on you. This is the one that... <sighs> this is the one that looks like, um... Oh, God. Uh, Gene Simmons from KISS. This is the KISS one. Definitely catching him. Get him. Oh, I mean, it's a girl, but whatever. Zigzagoon is caught! Yes! Sorry for blowing out your ears. Ooh, Nickerdoodle went to level 8. Neato. Learned Hone Clock. Cool. That was super exciting. It's dark normal. Thought to be the oldest form of a Zigzagoon. It moves, it moves in a zigzags and wreaks havoc upon its surroundings. Uh, yeah. We will call you... Star Child. Star Child has been added to your party. Oh my god, that was super exciting. Oh! Uh, yeah, I don't want you. Freaking weird looking ass thing. Uh. Oh no, I forgot to heal Snickerdoodle. Or Nickerdoodle. Oh boy. Well, I'm gonna heal. Nickerdoodle. Can't have her die. Oh good, thank god. Usually it's a risk to heal your Pokemon or switch your Pokemon out in a battle because that gives the other person or, uh, no, I'm, I'm gonna change that, the other Pokemon a chance to um, get like an extra hit on you. Which, I don't know if that's the case in this one, but that's the way it was in the older one. Okay, I'm just trying to get to the train station, bruh. Ooh, six times. That's cool. Uh, let's do beat up again. Stop leering at me, you freaking bird. Okay, okay. Alright, if it doesn't kill it, I might catch this one just for Pokedex sake. Ah, oh, crap, crap, crap. Stop, stop, stop. Oh! Uh, use a Pokeball. That and just to get the other Nicket out of my party. There we go. Nice. There is... Oh, well, I mean, I guess I could go back and catch the freaking squirrel thing and the freaky turtle. Alright, so it's fine. Jumping nimbly about, this small... Oh, I should probably start the timer. This small-bodied Pokemon takes advantage of even the slightest opportunity to disorient larger opponents. Nah, we're not gonna nickname him. Oh, that's cool. Let's add him to my party. And let's put this one in. Rook. Alright, Nick is sent to the box. Cool. Yeah, I guess I should catch this one for the Pokedex sake. Hmm. My little Nickerdoodle. Let's do some Honed Claws. I'm assuming this will make my attack go up. Raise the attack, yeah. Oh, and accuracy, that's cool. And that's just defense. Not too worried about that. Gotta get to a Pokemon Center soon, get that. Ooh, that was a critical hit in there. Oh! Damn, that's gotta be like set. Oh, that's only six. 
Well, that's a dark move, so I can understand why it really didn't affect Nickerdoodle that much. All right, let's catch this freak. I really shouldn't call him a freak, but I mean, it's not his fault. That's the way he was designed. I'm probably offending a ton of people who like that one. All right, got him. Cool. Ba -da -ba -doop. That was out of my Pokedex. Oh, crap. Well, uh, nah, let's just send him to the box. And... Oh, it's another one. Nah, I already got mine. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Okay, it's nothing. Alright, so we gotta get to the Pokemon Center right quick. Okay, let's talk to you. Hi! Not you, this lady waving. Hello! I saw Hop sneaking off toward the station. Okay, well thank you, just random waving dude. In order to bring our full strength and not at all. Okay, well whatever. Knew that. Let's go in here. Hello, sad old man sitting on the couch. Sonya and Leon used to have a healthy rivalry, but... But what? Leon loves Pokemon and loves Pokemon battles. I remember we always go out even on practice matches. Well, that's wonderful. Okay, thank you. Bye. <laughs> Come on, Alarios. You'll never beat me to the station at that pace. I'm not in a hurry, dude. I want to kind of, like, look around the town a little bit. Yeah, 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 whatever. All right, let's get in here. What do we got? What do we got? Let's heal up a little bit. Yes. Mm. Thanks for waiting. Nicket and the rest of your team should all be better now. We hope to see you again. It is Nickerdoodle. Thank you very much. Uh, let's check my boxes. Yes, yes, I already know what the boxes do. Alright, so let's get Meowth in there. Rookity. Let's get you in here. That should be good. Okay, what can I get? I No, I don't. Stop talking to me. Now nah, I'm here to buy. Oh, okay, now there's the Pokeballs. Okay, so I have 23 of those. I only have three potions. Let's get six of those. And let's... Yeah, let's get about a couple of them just to be on the safe side. All right, I'm out. It's over here. Ooh, clothing. What do you got here? Hello, lady. Hmm. Ooh, striped shirt's cool. That's new. <gasps> a hoodie. Oh, I love hoodies. Hoodie, hoodie, hoodie. Okay, so they're all hoodies. Gray. That's cool, but I do like the purple. But I do have a lot of black hoodies that are really, really nice. So, you know what? Let's get me... Yes. Okay, so... Skinny trousers! I oh, want no skinny trousers. Loafers? Who the hell wants some loafers? I don't want no loafers. Oh, ooh, okay. Canvas travel bag. No, I don't need a new bag. Ooh, ooh, skelly cap, huh? Me like the skelly caps. Other than knit cap. Ah, okay, what I have there is fine. Glasses! I need glasses. Those kind of look like... Oh, no, mine are silver, though. I mean... Yeah, sure, I guess. Uh, nah, I don't want gloves. 
Don't really want to do pants or a shirt just yet. Or a bag, because I'm pretty sure every location is going to have a different clothing store and they might have different options. That's the way it's always been. All right, let's go to the train station then. So what with the Delarios, how many did you catch? I caught a really special one. But look at how many you caught. You're well on your way to finding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. That's a good move. Star-shaped ray, so they kind of throw, like, uh, shuriken at people. It's a team like that. You can teach your Pokemon a new move in a flash. And you could uh, use it again and again, too. Uh, I teach them swiftly. Give me ages ago. Okay, well, thank you very much. All right. I guess we're going. Let's go to the new town. Not quite so fast, you two. What are you doing here, Mum? I knew this day was coming since the moment you chose Grokey as your partner, darling. Professor Magnolia was kind enough to let us know that you two were setting out. So here, at least a little gift and I'll set on your way. All the cut kit you'll need for camping. Ooh, camping gear, that's cool. I like camping. You put the set of camping gear in your bag's key item pocket. Everything you need to set up a tent and get cooking in a wild area. Or at a camping spot. Or in front of a Best Buy. No matter what happens out there, if you and your partner are together, I know you'll be fine. Aw, thanks, Mum. Thanks, Mum. Ha, <laughs> okay. And just think how lucky you are. M mother... <laughs> Dude. Mother to the first ever pair of champion brothers, because I'm certain to be the champion next. You'll see. He keeps saying that. Of course you will be, darling. Anyway, do have fun and take care of yourselves. You'll be welcome back home anytime. We're off. Wish us luck. Not that we'll need it. There are loads of brilliant trainers and all kinds of Pokemon out there waiting for us. I know, I'm excited. My excitement's running ahead of me even faster than the train can go, Larios. Come on, we're off! Okay, so I guess we're off. Ooh, this is cool. Moto Stoke. It's surrounded by a vast wild area. It's a real sight. There are all sorts of... Oh, <gasps> Panchem! Of wild Pokemon just wandering about. Plus, you can camp out, do a spot of fishing. I don't think I could ever get tired of it. All right, here we go. Hey, Mr. Station Master, isn't this the wild area? What are we stopped here for? Yes, this is the wild area station. Make no mistake. I'm sorry to tell you that the train is halted due to a flock of Wooloo on the tracks. Now you can see him in the background. What's there to be sorry about? This is brilliant. Ah, uh, brilliant. This wild area is massive. There are loads of Pokemon to battle here. You get it, don't you, Alarios? This is the best possible place to put together the greatest team and to grind and farm XP at. Okay, well, you seem to be excited about something, man. Find your way through the wild area to reach Moto Soak. All right. Wow, they were not kidding. This is huge. It's actually really cool looking. All right, off we get. Look at that. I, I was. Oh, it's so cool. That's Moto Soak way off that way. There, it's, a, it's Big Ben. And between there and here are countless new Pokemon waiting to be met. Oh, hello. And if it isn't Sonya. My grand gave me a proper earful in her way out. On her way. Those two young trainers are setting out on a journey. But what are you doing with your life? Ouch, Professor. Ah, uh, never you mind that. Nothing to worry yourselves over. Besides, I'd be quite curious about that Pokemon you two met in the forest. I'd been thinking I should take a look into it, so the timing works out fine. If I discover something really huge, then maybe even Gran will admit I've got some talent. Yikes. Being an adult has got its own challenges, eh? 
Dude, you have no idea. I said you needn't worry about it. I'm glad to be on the road, really. It's been ages. It'll be great fun to fish and camp and rough it outside again. Well, I'm off to go stick my head in as many of those red glowing dens as I can... Dude, that's not safe! Uh, dude, seriously though, in the tale of my legend, he's gonna die. And he's dead. What cheek? Dynamax Pokemon are really on another level, you know. You'd better Dynamax your partner Pokemon too if you want to take an opponent on that strong. You'll find spots here and there in the wild area that emit a red beam of light. Oh, that's what those were. If you think you're up to it, check them out. There'll be Dynamax Pokemon lurking inside. So with that, how about I send you off with a little treat from me? Pokemon Box Link. What is that? A device that allows you to access the Pokemon storage system. There are some places where it won't work. To access your Pokemon boxes while you're on the road, you'll be able to add Pokemon to your party or transfer Pokemon from your party to Oh, that is super cool. With a Pokemon box link, you'll be able to put Pokemon from your team into your boxes or take Pokemon from... That is really cool. That's... Re oh, that is so nice. It used to be the case where you'd have your six and you would sometimes be able to catch them, but they would automatically always go into your Pokeball... Or like your Pokemon storage box and you would not be able to access that until you got yourself to a town and a Poke Center. That's brilliant. Ooh, okay, well, I guess that does that. What are you? Vanillaite. Okay. Go, Nickerdoodle! It's hailing, wonderful. Uh, let's use beat up on it. Beat this little ice cream cone up. It's not very effective, dude. Ooh. Seriously, the hail heals it? Alright, well, let's catch it. Why not? Yes! Catcha! Vanillite was caught. Who? Oh, okay. Uh, would you like to give Vanilla a night? No, because I'm not really going to be using him as... Okay, those are other Vanilla Ites. Whoa, what was that? Oh, it's a Metapod. Oh, God, I was attacked. Oh, a Swinub. I'm glad to see those haven't changed. Let's beat him up. Ooh. Okay, so that one was good. Alright, that's pretty good. Let's see if I can catch him. Alright, let's get him. Click. Nice. Swinub was caught. Another ice type Pokemon. Oh, Star Child grew to level 7. Snifty. Uh, if it smells something enticing, it dashes off headlong to find the source of the aroma. No, because I'm not using that one. Alright, let's switch to Lychee being front runner. So I'm going to be dealing with ice type Pokemon. Then I'm going. Ooh, berry tree. What is that? <gasps> Onyx. You found a note. Someone drop it here. The large Pokemon you see wandering around in the wild area are strong. 
try battling one and it seems like you're in over your head, try to run. Run like the wind. Nah. Be yeah, right. Strong looking onyx. Not for lychee. Oh, shit. <laughs> Curse! Why does Onyx know that? Ooh, okay, so that's good. I mean, it didn't do dick diddly to it, but that was, that was pretty. Yeah, you get hit by that hail. Yeah. All right, so let's do double kick again. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yep, 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 yep. Seeing that one happening. Uh, use next Pokemon. You know what? Let's use Vanillaite. Even though I said I wasn't going to use it. Let's see if this does anything. Don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him. Ooh. Ooh. Now I wonder if I could catch him. I mean... It might be a... Uh, challenge to do that, I guess. He might break out of the Pokeball. Okay, so I won't let its guard down. Am I fast? Why is it so fast? Okay, that's stupid. Why the fuck is it that fast? I'm not running. I promised I would not run. This is not good. Okay, so I might have to do this and hope to God. What is that? Why does Onyx know that? Onyx should not know that. It's not a dragon type. It's a rock. Which it, I I have a feeling that this is gonna end well. Yeah, dragon breath. Mmm. Oh. And yeah, watch. That's gonna. Oh. Curse. I wonder if it's because of the curse like that. Did my thing turn off? Yeah, it did. Tackle. Oh, okay, that didn't do anything. Oh. Uh, what? I won't let its guard down. I don't understand why. What that is. Okay, this is this is gonna be really really bad because he's gonna kill him. Yep. Okay, so that's good. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Alright, alright, alright. Shit. That's actually a lot, so I'm gonna double kick it. Yes, okay, good. Come on, get it down in the red. Screech. Oh, thank God. Okay, so I might have a chance at this. Okay, so my defense harshly fell. That's 
Okay, okay. Come on, be in the ring, be in the ring. Okay, fight, double kick. Yeah, that's good, that's good, it's in the red. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Don't use rocks, I don't. Okay, good. Oh my god, I think I did it. Shit, I didn't avoid the hail. Okay, yeah, I, uh, I wonder if I could catch it now. Won't let its guard down. I don't know what to do about that. Double kick! Come on, kill it. Yes! Oh! Oh my god, yes! Woo! Oh! Oh my! Nickered. <laughs> Those two grew a lot. Holy shit. I heard a vanilla light. Is there. There's not a Pokemon healing person, is there? Oh, wait. I should be able to camp out here, I think. So let's try let's let's try out camping real quick and see what that does. It's not time to do that. Why? What is this? Uh no. Well, where the hell am- where, where am I supposed- How am I supposed to camp out and heal up? I thought that's what the point of the camping gear was, was to heal. Unless she heals me. Can you hear me? Yes! Oh, okay, good, thank you. Cool, thanks. Okay, bye. Alright, let's explore these wilds a little bit more. See if, uh... Tons of vanilla -ite. So we're sneaky sneak. Ooh, is that a Tyrogue? It is. Let's get Tyrogue! No, he's a fighting type, so using fighting moves on him really is like, oh, gonna do any good. Okay. Yeah, that getting buffeted by the hail is what saved me in that Onyx fight. But I don't understand what it was saying, like it won't let its guard down. Okay, well. Oh cool, Tyrogue is caught. Cool. Uh, even though it's small, it can be ignored because it will slug any handy target without warning. Oh, it can't be ignored. So it's a jerk. Uh, no. Send to the box. What? Yes, yes, yes. That's nice. Do -do -do -do. Yeah, so it seems like ice type Pokemon are abound. A note. Use the right stick to rotate the camera. Uh, yes. Okay. What's with all the vanillaite? <sighs> what are you? Look like the rabbits from Super Mario Od or Super Mario Galaxy, the Star Rabbits. Kaboosh, what are you? Yep, that's what they are. Bunnelby! Well, this is awkward. Let's tackle it. Or you know, kick it in the face. 
All right. All right, let's catch it. Yes, there we go. Funnel B was caught. Neat. All right, let's see it. It's very sensitive to danger. The sound of... Corviknight's flapping will have Bunnelby digging a hole to hide underground in moments. No. All right, we're sent to a box. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. All right, so there's Bunnelby's and... Vanillites in here. Sneak a little faster. You know if I got run. All righty. What's over here? Oh, pan gems. Yes, please. Ah, cute. There we go, tailing. Mold breaker. Ooh, it's pretty strong. Uh, let's tackle. Now, if I see the big one walking around, I ain't going after it. That onyx almost wiped out the party I had to begin with. All right, let's hit again, knock it down just a little bit more. And then we'll be good. Okay, yeah, we're golden. Jesus. All right, let's use the poker ball. Oh, whoa, I got a couple level ups. Holy crap. Puff and Fluff leveled up to nine. And Star Child grew to eight. Vanilla grew to eight. Well, yeah, okay. Oh, missed. Okay. Uh, Pancham's data was added. Wanting to make sure it's taken seriously. Pancham's always giving others a glare. But if it's not focusing, it ends up smiling. Yes. So you will be called... No, no, I... Ugh. Pandy Chan. Uh, add to party. Vanilla GTFO. There's a couple of them. Whoa, what the hell was that? Oh, he's just he's booging it. Oh my god. Oh! I guess I can't run. Ooh, this one's level 10. Double kick it. Yeah, see. Strong, but it's not very effective on it. Oh, sumo move. That's cool. That's not cool. Stop it! No! Oh my god, stop it. Shit. That's annoying. Oh, that's cool. He slows down when he gets hurt. Mm, Lyche was buffeted by the hail. So is Pan Cham. No. Bad. Let's burn it. 
setting fire to the pan jam. Get out of there. Yes, I don't feel like shaking the burris. Don't want to. Okay, so apparently I got 50 watts. The hell? Oh, whoa. Hi. Oh, that's cute. What's up? Yeah? Okay, bye. Oh, <gasps> Diglets? <gasps> what are you? Oh, Rog and Rolla. I'm still surprised that I know these. Let's just kick it in the supposed face. Weak armor. Well, so much for catching that. Ooh, sweet. Okay, so if anything shows that, uh, from what I know, light should be evolving at 16 and 36 or 35, I want to say. And I took a really big risk on picking the fire type because usually they... Screw it up so hard. There's been so many firefighting types for the final evolutions. I just <sighs> threw dirt at me. I just wasn't a fan of the fire cat. It could have been so much better. But whatever. That's my gripe about it. So hopefully the final evolution of this one is not bad. Um, Fennekin's final evolution, the Fire Psychic, was really, really cool. I would be okay if this was a Fire Psychic. Ooh, Puff and Stuff Learn Bite. Neato, Star Child went to nine. Ooh, Snarl, forget no move. What can I do for that? What's Snarl first off? Power, 55. Okay, yeah, let's get rid of Leer, because I think Leer is useless. Oh, all right, what we got? Diglett's data! It burrows through the ground at a shallow depth. It leaves raised earth in its wake, making it an easy to spot thing. Wonderful. Uh, no. Nope, send a box. All right, so I got the Diglett out of there. That's, that's key. So that was the sound of the Diglett, huh? Neat. Bunnelby, Vanillaite, I don't really need any of those. Ooh, shiny. Ooh, I got a tiny mushroom. Cool. Tyrogue. I could get a couple Tyrogue. Oh! I have a feeling that thing's just gonna destroy the hell out of my Pokemon. I ain't going over there. Oh, uh, that Butterfree might be issues. Um, how do I get the water Pokemon to, like, come up at me? Unless I gotta be s Another tiny mushroom? Yeah, another tiny mushroom. Ooh, got a couple tiny mushrooms! Ah! Okay, bye. Is it chasing me? Oh. It looks pissed. Okay, it didn't care. So that's lucky. Alright, well, I guess I can make my way over to where I'm supposed to be going. So many vanilla items. Oh my god, so many crazed bunnies. That one's tail is completely different from the other ones. Hmm, interesting. 
Okay, so what's up with... There we go. No! I wanted that vanilla light. Why, why has it got... Alright, Leitch, I'm just gonna have you burn the poo out of this one. Oh, fighting. Alright. Well, it's all that one wrote, I guess. Swin up. Ah, oh, that's right, I have Swin up. Okay, what does that do? Wild Vanillite, okay. I don't understand what the... I mean, it's not a shiny. Was that supposed to do anything? Okay, I have no idea why it was... Oh! Okay, well I don't know what the watt wattage just does. So I'm not gonna worry about that. I'm just gonna make my way over this way. Oh, s pillow swine. Don't want that. So the ones that don't hide in the grass are the ones that are going to give me trouble? You a trainer? Just crazy strong with... Nah... It's over? Why, why are there snover where it's not snowing? No warning. Oh, I made it hail. Crap, really? All right. Let's double kick. Ooh, don't kill it. There we go. Perfect. Yeah, Leitch knows what's up. Oh no, we use Leer. Ow. Let's catch it. Gotcha. Speaking of shinies, I know they're in the game. Ooh, Nickerdoodle leveled up to 12. Cool. Snarl. Uh, yeah. Let's get rid of Tail Whip. So anyway, I know shinies are in the game. With Pokemon Let's Go, you had to catch the same Pokemon every single time without having it run away. Or, like, accidentally, the berries that grow around its belly are like ice pops. Galarian and Darumaka absolutely love these berries. I don't know what that is. Uh, no. Let's send you to the box. Yeah, sure. But, um, uh, in other games. <gasps> oh, what spray? Anyway, in other games, it was just like at random, a Mudbray. If you um, found a shiny or not, I don't even think shinies existed in the first couple Pokemon games. Like red, blue. Was it, was it red, blue, gold, silver? No, uh, yellow came around that same time too. Oh god, I wasn't paying attention. Lychee's gonna bite it hard. Hmm. Okay, that's fine. I like Mudbray's evolution. I can't remember what it's called, but it's really cool looking. Nice. 
Nice. We're just doing good this time. Ooh, everybody's leveling up. Oh, Lychee grew to level 16. Sweet. That means Lychee's going to be evolving now, right? Yes, I still have it, folks. What? Light is evolving. Ooh, we get to see what he looks like evolved. Okay, not bad. It's kind of like an urban ninja type thing. Congratulations, your light evolved into Raboot. Not an uh, inventive name. It kicks berries right off the branches. It, oh, it kicks berries right off the branches of trees and then juggles them with its feet, practicing its footwork. So it's a sucker or a football. Oh, Mudberry's data too. It eats dirt to create mud and smears this mud all over its feet, giving them the grip needed to walk on rough terrain without slipping. Oh, oh, that's mud. Uh, no. <sighs> Yeah, let's add him to the party, and we will get rid of Swinub, because I really don't want him there. Just for now. Um... Is that a... <gasps> oh! Ah! It's a Growlithe! My first ever, ever favorite Pokémon! Oh, I am catching you. Oh, it doesn't have a Galarian variant, though. Ah, whatever. So do fire moves not work on it at all? They don't. Interesting. Okay, so those of you who don't know, and I'm sure that's almost everybody... From the first generation, my absolute favorite, all-time favorite, has been Growlithe and Arcanine. Those ones are, like, by far my absolute favorite Pokemon from generation one. And then I like Vulpix and Ponyta. But hands down, if I had to choose, I would choose Growlithe no matter what. And I always name them. Extremely loyal, it will fearlessly bark at any opponent to protect its own trainer from harm. Yes. Hmm, do I want to do it that way? No, we'll do IE. Emmy! That is what I name all of my Growlithe. Um, at the party. Well, not all of them. I do catch multiple, but... Mudbray, be gone, fool. And he is now part of the group! Ha! Ah! Oh, that's so cool. That's so great. Oh, there's another one. Oh, oh crap. I was so, so involved with this that I am totally out of time for this episode. But what an... Oh, this one's even stronger. But what an awesome way to end this episode by catching and fighting my favorite all-time favorite pokemon i don't care if it's plain or whatever i love growlithe and i can't oh my god i can't even right now i'm so happy it's included in this because i know some of them weren't which that's an issue with most people but i got a new pokemon game i don't care so with that being said i want to thank you guys so much for watching if you liked it let me know in the comments below, and as always, by subscribing, I get to see you guys in the next video.